Hi everybody, Rob Geese here. Welcome to my playthrough of Tomb Raider. This is episode 22, I think, and we just got to this room where uh, Lara came to the revelation that the Sun Queen here uh, is transferring her soul from person to person to person to become immortal, essentially. And my friend Sam is next, so we gotta go stop Matthias, the asshole and leader of the evil brotherhood of crazies on this island. And, uh... Just give my best friend. What the hell am I doing here? Uh, okay. Well, I don't want to miss anything, so let's go pick up this first. I have no choice now but to meet Hoshi. Uh, so this is Lara's thoughts on this on Hoshi's entry. Hoshi faced a terrible choice. I feel as though I am following her path, but what choices will I be forced to make? And Hoshi wrote, I have no choice now but to meet my fate. Tonight I climb the stairs to the chamber of the sun, but I will never submit to the ritual. I will not emerge the queen. Uh, none will ever believe what I now know to be the truth. A twisted evil beyond imagining lives within the sun queen. An evil that hungers for more than just the land and seas of Yamatai. This madness cannot continue. So I go to the chamber armed with the stolen dagger of a storm guard general. By the time he realizes what I have done, it will be too late. For the sake of Yamatai and all the priestesses that would follow me, I must die. Uh, I believe Sam is an ancestor of Hoshi. I think that's the storyline here, and that's why uh, Matthias is so keen on her being the one. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go this way, but this rope thing makes me think I can pull the door down. And I did. Wait a second, is this where I came from? This is where I came from. We are going to go this way. A thing you just saw me use is the, uh, crap, I forget what it's called. I think it's called the extender. It lets me kind of pull large objects with the rope, and it lets me, uh, when I'm actually climbing on rope, it lets me, like, go up, like, vertically really, really fast. Cool. So I think I have enough to get a pretty big upgrade. Uh... How did I miss that? I hope I'm going the right way. I took a break for a few hours since my last episode, so I kind of lost my uh, train of thought. But this this is the right way because I would have picked up that salvage for show. Sure. Lara is unable to fast travel after this camp. Oh shit! This is the final segment of the game. Well, let's open this bad boy up first. Satsuma porcelain vase. Probably early Edo period. Cool. Got all three. 100% daggers, 100%. I'm just like, just. Wow, I got a lot of these things. Not early on in the game, but lately. Look at all these 100%. Pretty good. Pretty good. Alright. Let's see what I got here. I got a skill point. So I can fast travel back and try to get more upgrades and shit, but I'm not going to waste my time. Cleverly use dirt and rocks to blind your enemies and leave them vulnerable to your attacks. Striking after dodging becomes even more deadly. I want to do that, because I was using this a lot against those bigger armored dudes. The, uh, storm guards. Do that. Sorry, I'm just turning down the volume on my laptop so you don't hear it. Uh, let's do it. Master it. Cool. Let's go. I got one left to finish the uh, brawler tree. At this point, I'm not sure I'm going to get all the skills unlocked before the end of the game. Uh, okay. Ooh. So that adds a new type of arrow, I guess it does. Those are rigged with grenades. Uh, improves accuracy for increased damage. Uh, yeah, I should do that, shouldn't I? Oh, wait. Mm, too late. Too late. Too late. 9 of 10 complete. Yeah, I can't afford the last upgrade here. I don't really need this out. No, I'm good. I forgot I got the other upgrades already. 
using some quite a few upgrades for this thing. I don't really care for that. That's maxed out. Mm. I can afford this. There's no damage. Yeah, let's do that. Cool. Pretty good. It's not bad. Alright. Open it. Yes. Crazy weather again. This is the ziggurat chasm. Pretty impressive architecture. Whoever built this back in the day. I don't build them like that anymore. Hey, it's Matthias. Why are you doing this, Matthias? Do you think that you're the hero, Ma? Everything I've done, I did just like survive. Sam's pretty flower headband. How many lives have you taken to do the same? There are no heroes here. Only survivors. Himiko's dangerous, Matthias. She's angry, she's vengeful, and she has real power. A mere mortal for a queen? A good trade for our freedom, I say. So he's just trying to get off the island, I guess? He wants me to go this way. Because it had me facing this direction. Not here. Get much XP from those things. See? Watch. When I press the extender, hold down E, I can fly up these things. I think I'm supposed to go this way? I'm not entirely sure. Um... Nope. You won't let me look down, so I don't really know. But I'll look down before I jump next time. Onto that, I guess. Yeah, all right. Do it properly. Jump and then press E. There you go. Got it. Yeah. Nice. It's a little awkward, but all good. Wind is wrecking this stuff. I bet you hundred dollars, hundred in-game salvage. Let's make it in-game salvage. And once I go through this building and structure, wind is gonna start tearing it apart. That's my curse. And I walk through old buildings. The old buildings fall apart. Right. Old school puzzle. Smash it! Hmm. Yeah, it's not the way. Why is that glowing yellow? Gonna break these. Um, it's blocking me from looking up higher. Okay, so let's see. Mm.
Why is it not grabbing on? <laughs> Weird. That's where it was before, right? Yeah. Come on, Lara. Gotta save Sam. Or sacrifice her something. Scrap shoot this. Ew. Let's eat. When I tell you, I told you the scene was gonna fall apart. Oh. Yeah. Lara, watch out! Those bastards are heading your way. We did everything we could to slow them down. Thanks, Reyes. Get to the boat. If I'm not back, we're not leaving without you. Oh, we'll Reyes loves me now. Jump! I guess I'm not supposed to climb that. This thing's gonna break, watch. Oops. Go. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Gotta shuffle up. Shuffle, shuffle. Oh shit. Hang on. There, I jump up, not sideways. Damn it. Ready? Here we go. No, what are you doing? Press up. Why is it jumping right? Yeah. Run, 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 run. Jump. E. I'm supposed to hang off that flag? I don't think so. Alright, here we go. Ready? Jump! Yes! For some reason, for some reason it keeps defaulting to jumping right. Not that time. Sun Goddess is pissed with me. Supposed to go down? Right, shift and grab. Oh, oh crap. I wasn't paying attention, I was looking at the next cliff. <laughs> Jump. No, how do you... Ooh. Come on. We all knew where she was supposed to jump. On the ledge, not sideways. It's a problem with these super linear games where that change controls your camera's perspective. It doesn't match the direction you're actually moving with the keys. Uh, ah. At least I get to do this part again. Fun times. Whee. Grab. Jump. Yeah. What? What? I've seen you jump further. How is that not the right? <laughs> I'm so confused. It's so linear, I actually don't know how to follow the linear path. Uh, ah. All right, take three. I guess I'm not supposed to go down there. So... I go left. Die. Do I'm gonna go in s Oh, up. I gotcha. I wanted to go on the big statue. 
Ziggurat Vestibule. I actually did need some ammo. Well, not enough salvage to do anything. Oh, shit's gonna fall down on me. As soon as I get here, everything breaks. Jump, grab. Almost there. Come on. I did it. Should have put on a jacket. Supernatural. Use your bullets. Shot somehow. Shit. Here we go again. We're done. Wow. Get to her. What is going on? Tornado time? Perfect. Get up, get up. I can get up here. Oh shit. There we go. There we go. Shooting. So. Again, crazy wind. I have to pick it up. Shit. Oh, pwned. Shit. I, press, I gotta dodge it first. Shit. Right. Do this time, watch. Shit. Come on. 
go. Hello. Something's happening. It's like I'm just going in circles killing people. I'm not really making an effort to get to the center. Oh my god. Pressing E, pressing E. Shit, jump! Why are you walking so slowly? Get up there. Oh, samurai versus 30 soldiers. The giant dude? Get off me, please. What? What? Oh shit. Too close. Oh shit, shit, shit. Does it hurt? Whoa! Time it! One more time, right? 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 Oh god, shit, shit, get up, get up, get up, get up! Ah! No! Ah! One second, I'm just responding to your message. Wow, shit, no, 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 get up, get up, get up. Sloppy there. Oh, shit. Give it to him. Yes. Oh, mash. Yeah. Oh, E, E, mashing E, mashing E. He's got nothing on me. Should have got a billion dollars from killing that. Ooh. All right. Let's go save the day. Wow. 
mash E, mash E. I'm mashing E, I'm mashing E, I'm mashing E, I'm so strong, come on. Oh my god, my left index finger. I press the trigger. Fire again, fire again. Oh shit. Yes, it finally happened. Oh, wield. Oh, look at that pretty face. He's so angry. You did it, Lara. You're a beast. Sal. Oh, Sam. Thank God. Um. Laura. What's happening? I made you a promise. A promise, Mr. Frodo. And I carry Where's her Laura? back. <laughs> She's got Sam. She did it. I think she's going to be okay. Twist ending, she is the sun goddess now. I could tell him that now. There are so many mysteries that I once dismissed as mere stories, but the line between our myths and truth is fragile and blurry. I need to find answers. I must understand. Cool. Uh, achievement unlocked historian. Achievement unlocked a survivor is born. Dragon's Triangle, south of Japan. Day unknown. New adventure? Need anything? Mm. Don't really know what happened to you on that island. Judging from those wounds and that look in your eyes on your side, I don't want to know. Anyway, we'll be home soon. Ah, I must have docked with the ship on the way out. I thought it was them beginning a new adventure. Gotta heal up first, man. Perfect. Just hit the three minute mark now. A survivor is born. So, hey, pretty cool, right? Gotta say, it was pretty fun. Uh, the puzzles were pretty creative. I did have trouble with at least two or three of them. Um, but, I mean, a lot of that has to do with. Um, oh, I'm gonna read this first. We hope you enjoyed playing Tomb Raider. We have worked our hardest to bring you the best game we could possibly make. Thank you for taking the time to complete our game. Oh, thank you for making it! Crystal Dynamics. 
uh, you know, creators of uh, long-time developers of the franchise. So, uh, anyways, like I was saying, it's it's weird when, when I'm playing a game and recording it. Like, I don't want to waste time. Like, if you guys <laughs> were watching me play Skyrim, you'd want to kill yourself because I'll spend a hundred hours just like looking through like paths in the trees or going through every single mine and cave. Um, as a bit of a completionist and explorer. But in a game like this, I don't want to waste time. I don't want to double back. That's why I wasn't going too crazy about missing uh, collectibles, especially when it comes to GPS caches. That's such a waste of time for me, so I'm not going to waste time. But uh, we did what we needed to do. We got a ton of upgrades for the weapons, most of the skill points. So not bad my first playthrough. Uh, don't have time to play through this game again, but it's a lot of fun. Uh, I am curious to see... Um, what the, look at these guys in their mustaches. Uh, I, mean, I am curious to see what the game looks like on the PS4 and Xbox One when they re-release the Definitive Edition, I think it's called. Uh, you know, with the next-gen hair effects. I don't know if it'll be too much better than what you see here on PC. Uh, I believe, yeah, I recorded most of this in 1080p, so, um, I imagine it's, it's gonna be pretty comparable, but... Uh, very cool game. I'm, it's, it's a smart, smart, smart reboot. Uh, I, I did like this more than Uncharted. Three, um, still love the original Uncharted, but this one, this one is very, very, very cool, and I am excited to see a sequel. Um, and they are making one, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be good. Now I can dual wield my pistols. Uh, awesome, very smart, and I hope, man, I really hope they can make a new film based on on this version of the character, not the uh, Angelina Jolie over the top version. So hey, there you go. Thanks for following along. If you were managed to stick through. The entire playthrough. Uh, thanks a lot. I really appreciate it. Uh, please like and subscribe so I can uh, keep motivated to, to play other games and keep recording it and making sure I find time to play some cool games that came out uh, throughout 2013. I got a lot of catching up to do, even though it's 2014 right now. Uh, the next game I'm going to play is the Stanley Parable. Although, um, how I'm doing the Tomb Raider videos, I think in the end it came out to be 22 episodes. I'm scheduling it all throughout January, so I already have it scheduled for the next three weeks, every second day, and I'm going to intersplice it with the Gone Home videos. There's only two or three more left as of today, as of early January. I think today's January 3rd, I already said that. Um, and then, so, you'll be you'll be seeing my complete playthrough of the Stanley Parable before we even get to this episode. So, uh, by the time this episode goes up, it's going to be end of January, I guess, so uh, i got to find something to play in February. I'm going to try playing some of the shorter indie games that made Game Rant's list of best indie games of 2013. We put 10 of them up there. I already did Gone Home. Um, like I said, by the time you see this, I will have already done Stanley Parable. And I hope to do um, Brothers next. A Tale of Two Sons, I think it's called. Um, hey, leave a comment on your thoughts on the game. Uh, if you played through the game yourself, uh, let me know your thoughts on the controls and what you would like to see changed or improved for the sequel. Uh, as you no doubt heard my little complaints here and there, you've Kind of got an idea of some of the things I found a little problematic, but in the end, very friggin' solid game. Definitely makes my list of best games of 2013. Totally justifies its spots on many of our end of year lists on Game Rant. Um, again, like and subscribe, leave a comment, and see you next time with another game. Cheers.